Okay, so now I guess we just gotta find the dude. What is everybody doing? Avid, av avid agriculturalist. There we go. Okay, so he should be armed now. Man, everybody got really, really motivated to come in here and just grab stuff. Not particularly great at stalking those, unfortunately. I think it's one of those where you just have to keep doing it forever. Be a bit busted to give all your people instant kill weapons. I was hoping. Well. I'm just going to put some of these things away. Uh, let's see. As well put away the wheat. Sort this down. So I have a medicinal plant. I mean, I guess what we could do is we could actually just start having very small green, uh, green roofs for some of the other, for some of the other, like, smaller crops. That wouldn't be a terrible idea. So I'm not really sure how many of these medicinal bulbs I'm going to have, need, or be able to farm. And so it might just be better to just go nuts like that instead. Maybe. Okay. Uh, let's see. So we want to make... I'm just gonna make a bunch of scarecrows. Cause yeah, unfortunately I've I've painted myself slightly into a corner. I'm out of dry grass. Eh, it should be a big deal. With my layout, just because I am I am kind of locked in this small zone. That said, I can easily put uh farms on top of like quite a lot of things, if I so chose. Let's see, take all these out. Hmm. I'm probably gonna worm, uh, oh. This is not what I was expecting would happen. But you know what? Grand scheme of things, I'm fine with growing far uh, some crops along the side here. Question mark. It's like a weird it's like a weird bonus farm terrace. But that's okay. Oh, wow. Okay, so this was a terrible idea in general. Uh, let's see, do I have any more grass seeds? I do. So I'm going to grass over this, because that, that should not be, that should not be farmland. Uh, let's see. Let's grab our stairs out. But yeah, I can, I can gladly have this area be a farm for, like, bonus resources. Let's see. We've got tons of food, but I could probably hoard more. Really wish they'd actually put these in the chests. 
They just keep cooking it. They don't not, they don't end up putting any of it away, or they put very small amounts of it away. Ooh, and we're about to level the town up again. Okay, you know what? They are actually stowing a decent chunk. We should probably Let's see sugarcane seedlings. Probably actually pull these out. Because at this point, they're actually starting to run out a little bit. And admittedly, they do just keep feeding it to their, uh... I love it how they're, they're all just like, go find us these, like, mysterious tomatoes. And I'm just like, oh, God, you have them. Here, here's your tomatoes. I mean, admittedly, it's not nearly enough. I can kind of understand it, but it's still dumb. Okay, seeds... Anything else? No, I don't think so. Oh, we just don't have any uh, cabbage seeds sitting around. Because, yeah, we just haven't been getting any anymore. We're swimming in wheat, but cabbage is weirdly low quantity. I do really appreciate that you can automate cooking. Sort of. I was kind of worried that it wasn't going to be automated at all. Oh, and he did actually, uh... He did actually get rid of this question. If I do it right here, does it get all of them? No. It's worth a shot. Has anybody else been pooping? Oh, wow, look at them go. Mind me, I'm here for your poop. There's not nearly as much worm food as I was kind of hoping for. Hopefully more will stack up while I'm like out and about. Uh, Pastor Al! Be patient. So if I place that right there, eh. I'm probably gonna make this upper area green first. Huh. It won't let me affect this at all. That's unfortunate. Oh, and he did get the lower sections. Cool. Okay, probably gonna leave the rest to... Whoops. No! I do really wish all of these guys dropped seeds for me, because that would be nice. Well, that that insta-kill move is real nice. And yeah, so even if the uh even if the moat doesn't prevent everything. Uh, let's see. It prevents a decent amount. Uh, let's see. Nope, can't get any, any more. So, it does look like a couple more of these farmers could actually use proper weaponry. Let's see how many more uh, sawtooth swords I can make. Oh, wrong place. Let's see. The answer is quite a lot, actually. I'll make, like, six. And just carrying them around, carrying them around, throwing them at everybody. Oh, you know what? Even easier. Who can I arm? He's already armed. Nanzo's already got it. 
I think they're armed. I think they're good. So I might have I might have gone a bit overboard with that, but that's okay. Hey, you know what I can do though? Actually level the town up. And base level's max. Okay, I was hoping it would actually keep going so you could keep unlocking more interesting recipes like further down the line. But of course not. Also bushes? Okay, so I can make roofs now. Flat wooden roofing. And also farming gear. Ah. So you finally worked out how to make roof tiles, eh? It's a bit late for this place, but I'm sure Lulu would appreciate having a roof over her head back in the Isle of Awakening. Get a while and kill it. Killipedes, dude, I feel positively overflowing with building power. Too right. I've never wanted to build anything more than I want to build summit right now. I can hardly contain myself. I feel it too. I want to build and build and build and build some more. Uh, are you a lot all right? I think you might need to have a little lie down. We'll be fine, Malroth. One day we will surely build something big enough to satisfy this urge. I only hope that the day comes sooner rather than later. And that is not the only good news. It looks like the sound of the bells brought some more budding builders for a field farms on the grow again. <laughs> you know what to do next, dude. Greet our new guests and welcome welcome them to our new home. Who's all this then? Do you tree on a farm? Who's responsible for this heresy? We are. We built this farm and everything on it. We're the all builders. What? If the children of Hargon knew about this, they'd have your guts for garters. Hey, dude. Uh, oh, that guy needs a new sword. Maybe you can't tell us apart on account of us all wearing the same hats. But we're the farmers who came the last time you rang the builder's bell. Earn it, ring a second time round made us, uh, as this made us, uh, made up our minds. We're going to be builders too. You'll be struck down a lot of you. Maybe happy to invite your own destruction, but we're not as stupid. You can stop it. Uh, you can knock it off right now with that holier-than-thou attitude. Stop beating about the bush and become a builder, all right? Oh, please say you'll join us. Making things is brilliant fun. It really is. Let's all be the builders and bring back Furrowfield Farm. <laughs> ah, be a builder. Be a builder. Have they lost their marbles or have it? Well, if you've well, you've convinced me. We'll join you. We're from Furrowfield, and we're farmers, so we may as well be Furrowfield farmers. Well, that was convenient. Man, you've been going ham on this game. Just got back here. I really like this game. Expect to see a lot of it over the next couple days. Okay. Avid Agriculturist. Needs a better sword. Can I not arm any of, any of the other ones? You? No. Not you. Not you. Not you. Clayton. Not that guy. And she's good. They're good. Okay, I think we're about as armed as we can get. Oh! So we just have, uh, grass seeds growing on some of these things. And medicinal plants, occasionally. So that healing bulb I planted down here was actually kind of pointless. I mean, it's nice. But, I guess I just needed grass more than anything else. Eh, so be it. Okay, uh, let's see, so next order of business, let's actually progress the game. I guess we should probably go talk to that, uh, that mouse. On the other side of this bridge because it says it has a question mark meaning something's up with it squeak 
Well, if, it's, if it isn't a human, and one with a huge grin on his face, too. You look like a mouse who found a wheel of cheese. Anyway, let me tell you about this bridge. It leads to a tomato farm, or at least the ruins of one. That's all that's left since the children of Hargon got to it. There might be, might still be some seeds there somewhere, but you need a furrow field retriever to sniff them out. Oh. So nothing fancy with that guy. Whoops. I almost fell in. Oh. They're getting jacked up by the bramble. That's amusing. Okay. Ah. I rather need these. Let's see. Yeah, so these slugs are just slowly killing themselves based on pure proximity. What is that? Oh, that's one of the flying things. We already got that. I think there's a cave in one of these spots, though. Maybe? I always get thrown off by these rocks. Bang! That's a whole bunch of tomato seeds. I'm sure once we get all the tomato seeds we need. I think we had, like, quite a lot just hanging out. Let's see. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, probably once we have all the seeds we need, it'll just be, uh... It'll just be... We'll, uh... We'll probably figure out how to actually make the, uh... Trellises? I think is the word? I forget. What is this? Oh. It's a... It's a heel slime. It's dead now. Wee bonk. So you wonder you on Switch or PS4? I'm on PS4. Uh, I I like my Switch, but I can't play multiplayer with it. And in the off chance that I play with somebody else for this game, uh, I had no choice but to play play this on uh, PS4. Well, I guess really I always have a choice, but still. Let's gather some more wood while we're here, because I'm kind of consistently low on it. And then we should probably go looking for that, uh, that supply of fresh water. Oh. We got a lemon tail and a crab claw. And I just realized there's there's an orc hang like a couple of orcs hanging out in like a, a little dwelling there. We should probably actually interact with these people and see what's up. Oh, the dogs dogs just spooked. You don't mind the lack of multiplayer, so you're fine on Switch. Yeah, I I didn't know if it had a co-op campaign, so it was like, well, maybe. You can use the stinky stuff, so. Change the ground in all sorts of ways. Just try it and see. Oh. The the night whatnots. Interesting. Guess we should probably actually work on the quest here. Personally I would have been fine for either platform. I would have loved it if uh it had some kind of like cool crossplay whatever situation, but no dice. Oi! You got some nerve coming up to a big bad orc like me with a dopey grin on your face. So, is there something you want from me? Yes. You're growing a new deer tree and you need to learn how to farm some more plants to finish the job. That's a pretty picky, uh, pretty plucky thing for a scrawny little human like you to do. Don't you know that everyone here follows the children of Hargon? You got guts, kids, so I'll tell you a thing or two that might come in handy once upon a time. This whole area used to be a tomato farm. If you look hard enough, you might be able to find some seeds still buried in the place. If you do manage to find some tomato seeds, come back here and I'll show you how to grow them. What's that? You already found some tomato seeds. Huh? I've been waiting a long time for someone like you to come along. Human worthy of learning the ancient secrets of growing tomatoes. Alright, listen carefully. 
Grow tomatoes, you need a, you need planting poles. You can't just stick the seeds in the ground and expect them to grow. Tomatoes can get pretty heavy, too heavy for the vines to support them. If you don't place planting poles to hold them up, they'll collapse under their own weight. It also helps to dig a ditch around the plants. If you fill it with water, the soil will stay wet without needing to be watered. Rain can water your crops, too, but the soil will still dry out over time. Can't expect the weather to do all the work for you. I got a field right here, so why don't you try growing some tomatoes in it? You need a planting pole for each seed. There should still be some stuck in the ground around here, so go and get them. My seeds. My babbages. Oh well, it's not a big deal. Alright! Looks to me like you've done everything the orc said. Do you reckon they'll sprout, sprout now? Either way, let's tell that orc we've done everything he asked. Oop. You're quite a little farmer, aren't you? You made a perfect little tomato patch. Great going, oh, great going, dude. Now we can grow tomatoes of our own. Say, you seemed awfully adept at setting up that veggie patch. That's a very unique hammer you're carrying. You're not a builder, are you? <laughs> Don't worry. I'm not one of those children of Hargon loons. I may be a monster, but I'm a Furlfield native, born and raised. Another builder came to this island long, long ago. It's thanks to his efforts that things were as good here as they were. It always looked like he was half asleep, and he was a greedy so-and-so, always raiding the larder he was. He was always ready to go to the extra mile when you needed him. Raiding the larder? You couldn't stay mad at him for it, though. He'd grow the finest crops you ever saw. One look at those succulent tomatoes and all was forgiven. That's why I'm excited for these ones to grow. Can't wait for a chance to taste builder-grown food again. I want you to grow as many as you can. These seeds aren't much use to me when my fingers are too fat to plant them. Oh, and there's one more thing I forgot to mention. My friend lives in a cave in the east of the swamp. She can teach you all about fertilizer, important stuff for farming. Did you go see her? But if you want to know more about Furrowfield, feel free to talk to me again. I'll be more than happy to help. Uh. Planting pole. Though I've already snagged quite a lot. Also, do we be an asshole to this guy? Nah, we're fine. Oh, get out of here, you. Wow, that's worth a lot of EXP. Well, oh, this stupid orc has died. It's absolutely terrible. I'm trying to help, but if the children of Hargon find out I've been cooking for him, I don't know what um, what me uh, what has me more worn out. All this cooking, all that worrying about what will happen if they find out. Whenever I'm tired, I always having uh, find having something sweet to eat helps. I don't have anything like that on hand. Normally, I just make some sweeties. It's really easy. You just have to cook some sugar cane on the bonfire. But I don't have the right ingredients right now. Uh. Oh, do I not have any sweeties? I guess I probably got rid of them all. Ooh. Mimics. Admittedly, mimics are not the only source of grass seeds around here, but the more grass seeds I can get, the better. How much EXP are these guys worth? Eh. Worth as much as that ghost. Oh. Should probably eat some bread. Brad, oh, bread is real filling, not so healy. Okay, there we go. Put these away. Put most of this stuff away. Uh, let's see, anything else? Don't need the stairs, don't need the bread. Got what I need. More mimics, murder the mimics. Give me your seed, hand thing. Yeah, we might as well talk to her. Let's see. Don't be afraid, little human. I'm a friendly orc. I love nature and everything in it, including humans. I've heard a rumor about you that you're starting a new tomato farm. Let me tell you, helpful hint. You want your vegetables to grow quicker? Try using the stinky stuff that humans used to put on the fields long ago. Apparently they're made out of night soil and wheat. Perhaps you could try making some yourself. You do. Come and show me, won't you? I've always wondered what it's, uh, if it smells as bad as the stories say. 
Fertilizer. Yeah See, not mimics, muddy hands. No, they are 100% mimics. Even if they're not named as such, they come from the mimic class of creatures. I know my Dragon Quest stuff. At least, mostly. What's up there, by the way? I've never checked that. Yeah, for whatever reason, um, I don't remember, they don't, do they have chests with, they have a chest with jewels in it, or no, it's a bag of jewels. Message written in faded letters. Dive at your own risk and perhaps your own reward. Oh, this is where we get the, uh, pure water. There we go. I was meaning to go looking for this. Okay, so we have actual clean water now. Uh, let's see, so view map, and we want to go back here. Because we got to go make, uh, some other things. Also, thank you, No Name Gamer, for the 10-month resub. Sorry if I missed your message. I didn't see one. Anyway, let's go grab some sweeties. Wonder if what bonus happiness even does for your town. Probably just prestige more than anything else. Question, if I go up to this, can I place? No. I was wondering if I could almost place like a whole bunch. The answer is no. Okay, so we got the sweeties that I was looking for. I gotta go get some wheat. Okay, and we also want to grab... Always make this mistake. Take this out. We might as well make a bunch of these. Uh, do I have? Yeah. I got more tomato seeds. I've got tons of tomato seeds. Which I should probably... Talk to this guy? Oh, no. Him. Limonek, dude! You did it! You prayed for a field bog and brought back tomato seeds! You asked an orc how to grow them, too? You're lucky you didn't get eaten. Well, at least you found out how it's done. You did find out, didn't you? We need them to grow properly to get de the Dia Tree all powered up. So go ahead and get them growing. Okay. Yeah, don't forget water around them. Honestly, I, I'm not going to. Space is a bit of an issue, and my people will water them manually, especially because I'm not actually trying to... Um, Oh, let's see. Fuel will be for tomatoes. Uh, let's see. My people water the crops for me, and yeah, there's just not a good spot for me to make. Uh, to make them? Place them? I don't know. Whatever. Because the, the water... The butter would either, like, take up some of my farmland, or the area around it, and, ugh. I don't know. Just don't want to do that. Not here. Maybe the next town. We will suss out exactly where the, uh, town limits are gonna be. Y'all gonna plant them tomatoes? Looks like they will harvest the tomatoes for me, but... Plant them? Maybe not. So what are you going to plant them tomato seeds you braved the bog for? Oh, win. Ah, tomato. My one weakness. I've never so much as seen a tomato, so I can offer no guidance on how they're grown. I suggest you try whatever methods you learned at Furfield Bog. Hang on a minute, Pastor Al. I thought you knew everything there was about growing plants and all that. I'm starting to think you're not all that... 
Uh, you're not the all-knowing oracle you made yourself out to be. Have you really earned the right to wear them draggy decorated robes? Silence, mortal. When did I make such claims? I merely stated I know almost everything. Limonak, have mercy, Pastor L, please. I didn't mean it. Um, so, dude, the orc you met in the bog taught you all about how to use planting poles, right? In that case, I'll leave you to it. Set up one of those poles and let's see if you can grow a tomato seed into a tomato sprout. It might have said spurt, which is kind of weird, but whatever. Okay, so I gotta take... I'll take out two. I really would prefer it if these guys do it for me. Okay. Next time, I'm going to give myself more clearance in the future. Huh. Might not be able to plant stuff in first-person mode. Was that enough? Or... Ugh. Inconvenience. Yeah, no water, no quest clear, clear maybe. Possibly. be inconvenient if I have to do it exactly the same. Or, no, I know uh, I know a dumb way of getting it work. Like, of getting it to work. Okay, so first and foremost... Oh, nope. Okay, I think I gotta fill this in. Okay. Then we wanna go back down. Move this around. Move that there. I mean, honestly, I'm not even sure if I really like this original setup. What the? Oh, don't do that. Huh. This is a weird and interesting conundrum. Yeah, maybe the tainted, maybe the water passing over tainted soil in general is doing it. I, I'm unsure. Well, in that case, time to uh, fix up all the tainted soil, at least in this immediate area. Plus, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be changing things around anyway. Okay, so you. Right. I need I need night soil. Please tell me you've actually been that's a bunch. 
Not enough. Y'all need to start pooping more. Like, way harder than that. But, I'll take what I can get. Uh, let's see. I guess I should make one fertilizer just so I have it on hand. Yeah, it might just be easier to get a lot of grass seed. Okay, plant that there. Should be good. So he'll convert that down. I'll start converting these over. Because I know... I know this is kind of wasteful, but again, all I have to do is just go kill a bunch of bodkins and we get everything I need. Oh, in retrospect, that's not even where I wanted to place that. Eh. Well, we gotta go back for pumpkin farming anyway. Uh, but for now, please tell me... This is pure water. Oh, hold on. Ah. Huh. This is a bizarre problem. that I probably should have foreseen. I think that's it. I think that's the last of the water. Dang it. I guess having a staircase there really made it, like, get confused. Okay, we should probably deal with these monsters before I deal with the rest. Especially because the Drakis like to take a long way around. Or not, they're not Drakis, they're imps. There we go. Okay. I'm back, you. Nope. You're not escaping me. So yeah, we might wanna we might wanna add some extra layers to the uh to the murder fort. Just so those imps can't Okay. For a second I thought it was about the imp was actually about to uh The imp was about to Or not the imp, the skeleton was about to start scaling the wall. Let's see. Anyway. Yeah, so it looks like you have to have pure, like, entirely, uh, pure... Pure ground, otherwise it ends up getting corrupted. Which is interesting. I'll keep that in mind. Uh, let's see. Can I... Just gonna move those elsewhere. Uh, let's see. So first and foremost, I need stairs. Let's fix this. 